Kia ora whanau, kia ora friends. I'm going to make some uh, mussels uh, deep fried uh, with a bit of uh, herbs and spices and all the things that we love. So to get us going, put a couple of eggs in here and we'll just smash those up a bit. Not making a cake, so it doesn't need to be beautiful. Sweet. Now we're going to make the uh, flour mix. So I just use plain flour. I don't like to use corn flour on this. So a bit of plain flour. Here we've got a bit of curry powder. And obviously you can add as much or as little as you like. But uh, it also gives it colour as well, so I'll add a bit of, so quite a bit of curry powder there. A uh, touch of garlic salt, not too much of this stuff. So this is quite strong. Uh, to add to that, I've got a bit of chilli powder, uh, give it, uh, the dish a bit of heat. It also gives it a bit of colour as well. Uh, I like my chilli, you can probably tell, so a bit of chilli there. Uh, this one here is uh, saffron. Um, saffron has a really uh, lovely flavour, but it also adds a, uh, uh, again, colour to the final result. So that's quite a bit of saffron. Uh, last year we've got a bit of white pepper. Go hard out with the white pepper if you like that. Bit of salt. Give it a bit of salt bay. Don't need too much of this because we've already got the garlic salt in that. Last thing you want is it to be too salty. So that's what the mix looks like a bit. And we'll just stir that up a little bit. Get everything nice. I can tell just by the colour that I probably want a little bit more chilli powder in that. I like my chilli, nice and spicy. You can already smell that mix. So that's what you need. Put all the stuff to the side. And we've got our uh, Mussels that I've just finished showing, so nice fresh green lip New Zealand mussels. So all you want to do, grab your mussels, chuck them in the egg. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight muscles. Two. So you just want to coat that in air. These delicious little morsels of home brings back so much memories. Just just the smell of muscles. So I've got my deep fry already on. She's already cranking, ready to go. So, you guys might be surprised at the actual colour that this stuff comes out of after I'm done. And that's mainly due to the uh, saffron um, and also the chilli powder. I actually cooked some for my dad in the weekend and he made a comment that they actually look like uh, KFC chicken wings. Pretty crack up. They certainly don't taste like it. Okay, so last one. Back to the side. Okay, so we've got. Just get them all covered in this nice mix. You can see the colour there already starting to come through. Don't be shy, get it all covered in that. 
Okay, so that's roughly what they should look like. Okay. A lot of people make a batter, and that's nice. Uh, nice battered mussels are nice, but this is something a little bit different. And uh, you just give them a light dusting, and they actually uh, they almost come up quite crisp. So get rid of that. Get rid of some nice clean fork. Okay. So we're almost ready to go. So we'll chuck. You don't want to chuck them all in at the same time. You want them to move a little bit. And you certainly don't want them to stick together. So, okay, we'll just do a few at the moment. Chuck these in. sound change. Again, I don't like to cook mine too much. Okay. Believe it or not, that's all it takes. And as you can see, they actually do look a little bit like uh, KFC chicken wings or uh, Just want to finish off the last few here we've got. There's a nice fat one. And that's daddy's one. And that's daddy's one. And what the heck, that's daddy's one too. So, finish the last three. Again, you can actually hear the sound change. Uh, water mixing with the oil, but again, you don't want to cook the hell out of it. This oil and drip off these a little bit. Probably should have put some paper towels down here, but oh well. Mind my fingers. Okay, farmer. These are my uh, deep fried green lip New Zealand mussels, and I think you'll have to agree they do look a little bit like um, uh, KFC. Colonel Sanders must have been onto something. And uh, the best way to eat these things is by yourself. Mm. Choice. Give it a crack. Latest.